Santa shark to do 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 to do Santa shark to do 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 Santa shark. Hi everyone. Hello and welcome back to Kels and John and a fun evening that we are about to have at the Give Kids the World Village Night of a Million Lights which is their Christmas event right here at the village in Kissimmee, Florida. Yeah, it's not too far from Disney. It's about mm -hmm. 15 minutes and this event is a ticket event only so you have to purchase well in advance yeah. but it, it's going on from I think the 13th of November till the 3rd, 3rd of Jan. January so it's amazing that they're doing it that long yeah but look at all these homes that have been decorated in all the different lights it's and beautiful we just got amazing. here yeah. and we're so excited to be visiting it's our first mm. time here ever and to be supporting this amazing non-profit we weren't overly familiar with this mm -hmm. charity so we looked into it a little bit we knew it involved you know gifting kids that were critically and terminally ill with their dream vacations mm -hmm. but it's an amazing story and we will leave a link in our description to the background of this incredible charity that does so much for kids around the world it's amazing absolutely so if it's something that you can't make it because you're nowhere near this area we'll definitely show you what this place has installed because I'm excited for it. There's so many lights. Over three million this place has supposedly. Yeah. I started counting already. <laughs> One, <laughs> two, three. <laughs> three million. It's gonna take years for us to count these. This is amazing. Amazing. And just looking around, look, we're right at the entrance plaza. <laughs> you can see where those three million are coming from. Yeah, you can. You can see it everywhere. Let's go have a look around and just see what this is all about. I'm so you know? excited. Yeah. The different companies have sponsored the lights for different houses. So these were done by Waterworks. Yeah. And walk around and point out some of the businesses that have supported this. So I think it's so cool. It is very cool. Pink house. Yeah. I wonder if you get to choose the different colors that you want to put into the house. Oh, this one's like a beach theme. Look at that. There's yeah. a beach. Very cool. I love the flamingo. So cool. Hello there. Look, okay, that's a happy octopus. It's a very happy octopus. Yeah. I'm going to take a picture of this one. They have like truly lovely homes. Yeah. The whole concept behind this is that kids and families can come here and pay nothing for these dream vacations. Yes. Which is why it's so great. <laughs> Look at that. Another Christmas tree. This one's from Enterprise. You know, you want to rent their car. Look at this tree. It's like a little photo op spot that you can do. Oh, look at that. Theme parks, but make it but fashion. Make it fashion. This is from the Lost Bros. Yeah, if you yeah, guys they're... follow the Lost Bros on Instagram, I think this is an incredible thing that they've done. Very nice. Look, there's still some of their shirts. <laughs> <laughs> Crayola. I really love this one. Wow. Look how, like how much all the houses are decorated. Like it's not just like one has one's covered, and then one has a few. The whole place is lit up. Yeah. It's incredible. So many lights. That's what he said. Look, there's more in the background too. I counted about 150,000 so far. I think so. Around there. Wow. Boston Wheeler. A boat company with a Christmas tree on it. Everyone has a Christmas tree bit. Okay, this one right here is incredible. Look at the grassy uh -huh. ceiling. Oh, wow. Roof. I like that. Wow, it changed colors. Wow. <laughs> you like this one? Yeah. I like it because it changes colors. Yeah. And I like the little simple bulbs that line the greenery too. They look like chili peppers. <laughs> they do. It's hard to tell from the camera. <laughs> but they look like little chili peppers. There's a Lego one. Is oh, that a Lego? Wow. Let's go check it out. Yeah. Oh. This place is amazing. It's a Lego wreath. Wow. So this one's by Legoland. By Legoland. Look at that. So this one's Legoland. Look at that. I love the snowman. <laughs> it's a random snowman right in the middle. This one's cool too. This For is any from soccer fans or football fans. Yeah, Orlando City. Look at the goals. <laughs> yeah. They're lit up. 
And the balls are lit up too. Look at that. Oh, yeah. I see an astronaut. Kennedy Space Center. Space Center did it. Smile. You're on camera. <laughs> Imagine you're in the moon riding on that thing with that guy. Oh, uh, I like this Margarita one. Oh, hello. It looks like a golf cart. It has a retro look to it. Oh, yeah, I'd like to drive that golf cart. Some beach chairs and lounge. This is the water. You see the sharks? Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool the way they did that. Merry Christmas, Nolan's roofing. Do you see a Santa do. shark before? <gasps> Santa shark, Santa shark, do 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 do. Santa shark, do 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 do. Santa shark. Oh, I like that one. Oh wow, look at that tree. Wow, Amberville. And all of these like little attractions and rides are included in your ticket price of twenty-five dollars. So yeah. Right. And they're all wheelchair accessible. They are. Very cool. So this is the Universal. Dinosaur, yeah. Oh, so Universal did this whole area here? You wanna check it out? Oh yeah. So they even have a putt-putt golf. Yeah, which yeah. is so amazing, right? They thought of everything. So they like have. You need to be close to like a home base. If let's say you didn't you couldn't leave. Right. You can still enjoy yourself here. I love it. So much to do. Yeah. <laughs> I like this guy. Yeah, he has a hat on. Or <laughs> a wreath on. A wreath on. <laughs> I'm going to call him Aretha. Alright, Aretha. <laughs> this is Aretha. We'll see you next year, Aretha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this marks Dino Putt. Very cool. Very cool Dino Putt Putt. I like this area a lot. Yeah. All the lights. This one I love, it gives me like full full Grand Floridian vibe. Oh, I can definitely see that. <laughs> Look at all these lights. I'm at about a million now. I think so. <laughs> you counted a million already? Yeah, I think so. Uh, like one million and three, I think. One million and four, a million and five, <laughs> one million and six, one million and seven, a million and eight, a million and nine, a million and seven. I don't know. I love this tree. So do I. Look at that. It's like a tree with bubbles. Lots and lots of bubbles. Bubbles. <laughs> bubbles. Look at that. This is Millie's butterfly garden. And look at this Christmas tree look, with all the all, Disney that's stuff. That's all the... We bought that ornament. <laughs> all the Disney ornaments look, section. <gasps> There's a bunny. Is that a Christmas bunny? It is. Let's go check. She's dancing. <laughs> oh, beautiful. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Yay. Nice little light show there. That bit reminded me of the Osborne family light. <laughs> yeah, I wish they do more of that next time. <laughs> yeah. Definitely. What's good is that this is the first year that they've done this. Amazing. And you know, as years go by, it gets better and better. This yeah. is already an amazing feat, what they did here. Oh, dancing tree. Oh, there was a button there. Just a little glimmer. Yeah. <laughs> Look, a little carousel. Oh, yeah. Under the mushroom. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, let's go in here. It's a castle. Ooh, it's almost closed. Oh. The Star Observatory. Oh. Oh, yeah. It's a 
this is Stella's Star Observatory. So Stella the Star Fairy makes sure that every child visiting Give Kids the World Village receives a special golden star to make their own. She collects the stars every evening and uses her fairy dust to place them in very special locations in the sky. She polishes each star with fairy dust before flying off and placing it in a special galaxy where it shines brightly for everyone to see. And she and her fairy friends use their pixie powers to make sure that our stargazers and families can always see these stars no matter where in the galaxy they are. Go, put your face in there. <gasps> Look, I'm a king! <laughs> You're the queen, lady! Yeah! <laughs> I look like King George. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Look at that. Wow, look at that. It's so high. So many stars. We were speaking to this volunteer, Jack, who told us that every kid that comes here gets one of these stars and it goes in a box. And then it kind of rattles around when Stella the fairy is grabbing it. And then at night time, it ends up up here. And then there, each one of those represents a wish kid. A wish kid. Yeah. We also learn that there's Christmas once a week here. Every and Thursday. And right? Mum's birthday once a week. Go look inside the tree. Yes. Look at this, it's a playground. How magical. Oh, I'm a little kid. <laughs> It's right in there. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, look, bees. <gasps> There's a door. Is that a door? Oh. Yeah, it looks like a cricket door. Oh, oh look. It's a, the Cheshire cat. Oh, yeah. And look, there's a little door. Should I knock? So we're back outside. Go check out the rest of these houses. Is that Santa I see over there? Yeah. <laughs> Look, it's Santa. Santa. Can you go wave to him? Yeah. <laughs> so this is the outside of the fairy tree where we just were, where that big playground was. So we were inside the tree. Old Elmer. <gasps> it's snoring. He dreams of searching for his roots to rain and snow and fog. They must be pleasant dreams because he's sleeping like a log. <laughs> so we just had a nice cup of hot chocolate. Yeah, so included in your ticket price is hot chocolate and ice cream. Yeah, one or the other or both. Whatever and you can have as many as you want. Yeah. It's very nice that they have that. So, yeah. you know, it, like tonight is quite chilly. It's hot chocolate. It was very nice to have. This is a little ranch. You can see the little barn in the middle. Yeah, so you can go for pony rides. Stay here. Yeah. This is a Christmas tree trail. It's gonna be a lot of Christmas trees coming up. I think so. <gasps> Let's see what's on this Christmas tree. This Look at that. Margaritaville. Margaritaville Christmas tree. Oh, all the Disney ones. Oh wow! Look, that's my favorite Epcot outfits. I love that ornament. Three Christmas tree. This one's just bubbles, regular really? bubbles. Four Christmas tree. <laughs> this one is called Lighthouse, Holiday Lighthouse. I think if you want to decorate your house, you just go to them. <gasps> Four Christmas tree. Another Disney. Oh. Five Christmas tree. Six Christmas tree. More Christmas tree. <laughs> Another Disney one. Seven Christmas tree. <laughs> Look at this pink one. <gasps> Pink eight Christmas tree. <laughs> this one has kitty claws and woof woof. And the safari Sam right there. I can't lost track. How many is it now? Is this eleven? Okay, I have to go back and recount. Twelve. Lots of Christmas trees. Look at all those big bubbles on the trees. Oh. Wow. Oh wow. <laughs> Yeah, Cinderella and Prince Charming. Oh. Wow. I love the Cinderella one. So what's your favorite house in this whole place? 
beautiful so far. I loved the castle with all the stars. I yeah. thought that was such a lovely sentiment behind it. It was lovely to see that. But just based on light, I think Cinderella's castle. Yeah. Cinderella and Prince Charming was nice. The Cinderella and Prince Charming house. What about you? You chose the exact same thing I chose, which is the star castle. Yeah. Where you had all the stars and then you had the different, where you got inside the trunk of the sleeping giant and just the fact that we got a chance to speak with one of the volunteers yeah. that told us more about this area and, and the organization what he does. and yeah. the organization it's amazing this place is amazing did you ever see a grinch mow a lawn before have i ever seen a grinch mow a lawn before with that look in his face i think he's trying to pretend to mow the lawn so he can steal people's presents like, no he's stealing christmas oh, he's stealing no. all the lights Oh, all of the lights. Can steal Christmas. Oh, he's happy. Look at that. He was <laughs> nodding his head. They got WWE next, and they added a wrestling rink. So funny. Look, it's... I wore the right outfit today. <laughs> yeah. Look at you. You matched, lady. You matched the castle. Look at Carolers. Yes, Carolers. Oh, there's Bumble some games there. Trail. We're playing whack a mole. You want to play whack a mole? Alright, you ready, guys? Yes. Yeah. Three, two, one, whack the There you go. I'm gonna donate that. Thank you. Very good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Have a good night. Good night. DIY unicorn. Well, I like a good craft. Yeah, you know, I think so. someone will enjoy that. Actually. Crochet unicorn. So they work with Toys, Toys for Tots. Tots. Yeah. Another great organization. So yeah. it was $5 for both of us to play whack a mole. Yeah. And whoever wins gets a prize. <laughs> yeah. You can take it or donate it. If you want to ride the the spinning roller coaster bit? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> this one. This, oh, this, one? this one's The ones that's spinning. Oh, that's a fast one. You can tell. All right. What is it? Do we have to pedal? Yeah. We're like in a hang glider. You see? We gotta cycle it. And we have to, we have to <laughs> cycle. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> oh, wow. Bye. Oh, I was like, what is that? And then we're hitting the trees. We're so, we're so we're far so up. so high. Look at that. Pedal, lady, pedal. I'm pedaling. Wow, oh. we're dancing. <laughs> this is fun. That's a long ride. It like, is. I can see my house. Wow. This is so fun. <laughs> that was so much fun. <laughs> Fun. And we were over there for a long time. Like you don't get rides that last that long. My legs are exhausted. <laughs> yeah, we went like around all of Florida and came back. <laughs> now so. that was free, not only for us this evening and as part of this event, but also as part of the village. Yeah. So if you and your family stay here, you do get access to all of these things for free. Yeah, everything is free other than like the gift shop is what we were told. Yeah, so that's amazing. I love it. Yeah, this place is so nice, so much, and it's huge, it's like really, really big. So Gift Kids the World had their own house too. Yeah. I love it. But for anyone at home that wants to support this amazing organization, you can text N-O-A-M-L to 44321. Yeah. See the Ripley's one? Oh, cool. It's like the smallest car in the world. Like a boy made of toys. Look at the tallest man. And he's dressed like an elf. That's the tallest elf in the world. He's taller than Buddy. Kringle's go car repair. Yeah, this one's my fun spot. Oh, I love it. That is so cool. <laughs> they brought the go karts here from Fun Spot America theme parks. I 
And that about wraps it up here at Give Kids the World Village. It was so much fun. It was a great, great event. Yeah. Like I'm really pleased we did that. And I hope it's something that can become a bit of a tradition, a tradition every yeah. Christmas. So this is the first year that they've done it. And they did such an amazing job. Mm. And there's so many people that um, actually donated. It was such a worthwhile cause, isn't it? It is, like it, yeah. It really is touching to hear what this organization does, how it started, and you know, how they grant wishes for so many families and, and children around the world. We were speaking to a volunteer today about how everything worked. And one thing is that he mentioned was that no one really knows about this place. I didn't know about it and mm. I've lived here before. It's so hidden from the public, mm. but it's here. And I think what this event did is actually open it up for the public to know that it's here. Yeah, I think it's going to do incredible things for Give Kids the World as an organization, as a non-profit. And it's, it's nice to see it getting the sort of exposure that it, that it deserves. It was so much fun seeing all these houses just lit up in different ways. Yeah. It's the side of Christmas, it the is. side of the Christmas holiday. And talking of, we've got a little something oh, yeah. to commemorate our trip. So John ordered this online when he bought the tickets. Again, it was $25 per ticket. And then how much was the ornament? I believe it was only $10 and it's an ornament yeah. of this event. So this one was done by Heather at age eight. I believe this is the ornament for this year is Heather's uh, painting, which is nice. That's really cute. And it's not something that you can get at the event. So if it's something that you really want to have, definitely order it with your ticket. Mm -hmm. One thing about the tickets is that it is a two hour time period. Plenty of time. Which is plenty of time. We actually walked through the whole lot, taking our time, staying at the pool, listening to some music while we drank our hot chocolate. And we didn't rush at all. Two and, hours is plenty. And we got to see every single house. So mm -hmm. it's definitely something you must do. It's fun. Definitely come and check this place out. Yeah. And if you can't, do check out the organization. Just yeah. learn a little bit. Donate if you can. And if it's something that you can't make throughout the holidays, you can volunteer. They have a website. 1800 a week. Yeah. Volunteers they have. They have there are people that volunteer all the time. It's a great cause. We'd love to volunteer sometime. Oh, we will. Yeah, but that's it. That was our night of a million lights. I hope you enjoyed this little look at this event. It's just brilliant. Like, really, really loved it. Uh -huh. And until our next Christmas event, I guess we'll see you real soon. Yes, we'll see you again soon. Bye for now. Bye.